All right, the same way I added this uh, invader guy up here using the uh, before pseudo class, I am going to add uh, some guy right down here using the after pseudo class. And since uh, I'm going to be all the way down here, well, well, you know, I could do this a number of ways. Um, I, I, you know what? I'm gonna. I used the before class on on the header. So why don't I use the after class on on the header as well? Who, who knows? Who who cares? You know, I could do it on the footer. I could do it on the article. I could do it on anything. But uh, why not? I, I, there's no good reason for me to use. I mean, there's no better or worse reason for me to do it anywhere else. I mean, my CSS has no semantic value, right? So let me start again with my content. URL and now I'm looking for my my duo over here cool and uh, let's do I'm gonna need the position absolute because otherwise it's just gonna sit underneath the header um, why don't I do what do I want bottom zero and I want them also to the right so right zero let's see where um, this gets me Ugh. All right, are they here? Oh, here they are. Look at these two guys. Whoops. Yeah, here they are. Now they're peeking in over here, but we want to bring them down, right? So let's see how we do that. We do our bottom is set to zero, and that's zero of the article. So let's move. Okay, to the right. Let me do a negative ten to kind of bring them. Uh, or negative 2 em to bring them a little bit outside. <sighs> Sorry, I keep on pressing my shortcut keys for explore for ex refreshing Explorer aren't the same as my Mac. So um, here we go. All right, maybe I could bring it two more. Cool, cool. And now the bottom. I don't know what I'm thinking. <laughs> testing this stuff on the Internet Explorer first, but I'm feeling crazy for the video. Uh, yeah, let me bring them back just a little bit less. Let's see. Cool. Oh, yeah, they're coming. They're, they're about to blow these barriers, no problem. Uh, so let's see what it actually looks like on a real browser. <laughs> ha, ha, ha. A uh, little jab over there at Internet Explorer. Very good. Yeah, that's cool. That's totally cool. I like that. Let's see what it looks like at um, iPhone with. Ah, that's pretty cool. I, I I see it interfering with the. Uh, this site was created for educational use only. My little um, thing over here. But you know what? I'll work with that. I, I'll just simply actually make make that content a bit smaller, um, and that's cool. But 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 there you have it. I mean, um, just I basically using the after class, uh, the after uh, pseudo class on still my header, which is way up here. I got to put these bad boys right over here, and um, you know it's unlimited. I was just now that I'm looking at some of this, I could potentially even put another invader kind of um, hanging to the left over here. Um, I have a couple of options for hooks. Maybe I could put it. I could hook it to the paragraph text. Maybe I could hook it to the element, um, to the image over here. Maybe I could hook it to the whole. I think this is a whole section called portrait. Or anyway, the sky's the limit. So you really have nothing to complain about if you're trying to pop elements anywhere in the page.